It's Family Fortunes. And yes, the 100 people to name a famous Arthur. Kenny. Um, Shakespeare. Arthur Shakespeare. <laughs> <laughs> name a famous robber. Joe. Um, cops. <laughs> people to name something you wouldn't try even once. Matthew. Sex on a train. <laughs> Sex on a train! <laughs> no! <laughs> Funnily enough, our survey people didn't come up with that one. A slang word for money. Eva. Bitch. Pardon? <laughs> bitch? What's a bitch for money? <laughs> no, not mummy. Oh! Money! <laughs> something a dentist says. Rob. Just a small prick. <laughs> People to name something your car can have two of. Paula. Wheels. <laughs> Isn't that called a bike? <laughs> There's something people have more than two of on their body. Eddie. Arms. More than two arms you've got, have you, Eddie? Something that comes in sevens. Caroline. Oh, fingers. <laughs> A part of the body everybody has only one of. Sarah. Big toe. Any part of the body beginning with the letter N? Knee. <laughs> Name a place where you would keep a pen. Marie. Zoo. <laughs> you want to write something so you're going to go down to the zoo to get your pen. <laughs> People to name something you associate with the sea. Ron. Deck chairs. should know about a man before she marries him. You just got it, Lynn. What would you what would you say? His name. His what? Name. His name. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. His name, yeah. It'd be lovely, wouldn't it, in the back of a car? With whom am I having the pleasure? <laughs> Apart from the doors, we asked a hundred people to name something that people open. Ross? Bowels. Something people close. Legs. <laughs> a hundred people to name a place where you wouldn't expect to meet a nun. Janet. A brothel. <laughs> hey, you jump on and ride. What do you think? Your partner. <laughs> That's something you do when visitors are expected. Big. Pardon? Big. <laughs> Make a cake. <laughs> Never heard that before. <laughs> Is that a northern expression? <laughs> Be-icky. Oh, bake! Big. <laughs> <laughs> it's like big, big! Something associated with the X-Files. <laughs> um. <laughs> we could show you an episode of it now, by the way, if you want to. Um. Um, what are you looking to her for? You can't ask her. <laughs> Uh, oh, Mel! Television! <laughs> a Shakespeare play with oh. a person's name in it. Midsummer's Night Dream. Midsummer's Night Dream? Summer. Midsummer Night's Dream. That's the one. Let's have a look at that. For Midsummer Night's Dream. 
No, hang on a minute. With a, with a, <laughs> did you Sam listen Sam to the question? Sam a Shakespeare girl's play name. with a person's name in the title. There's lots of little girls called Summer. <laughs> a character from Alice in Wonderland. Alan. The Tin Man. The Tin Man. <laughs> Alice and her little dog Toto. I'm going to name something associated with the three bears. <laughs> Betty. Red Riding Hood. <laughs> porridge, nice. Porridge. Let's have a look for porridge. <laughs> Carly. Red Riding Hood. <laughs> she said that. <laughs> you never heard that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've already had it, Charlie. Porridge. It wasn't there. What? Porridge. Porridge. We've had that as well, Charlie. <laughs> so has Goldilocks, I think. I think a bird with a long neck. Um, blackbird. <laughs> I'm going to risk saying it. If it's up there, I'll give you the money myself. A blackbird. Three lives have gone, so the Banyaras get a chance to steal Lee. Naomi Campbell. A <laughs> hundred people and ask them to name a way of toasting someone. Michelle. Over a fire. <laughs> Tell you what. If it's up there, I'll give you the money myself. Take with them to the beach. Turkey? The, f <laughs> the first thing you buy in a supermarket. Uh, turkey. <laughs> the food often stuffed. Turkey. <laughs> I said to you, <laughs> name something people take with them to the beach. You said... <laughs> <laughs> the first thing you buy in a supermarket, the answer was... <laughs> and the survey gave you... A food often stuffed, you said... A and that gave you...